Hello, everyone, and welcome to this special broadcast. Today, I have with me a very special guest, Dr. R. Ravi Tannan, who has recently been awarded the Padma Shri for his dedicated work in taking cancer care to the poorest of the poor in our town, Silchar. He is somebody who has paved way for innovative and affordable health care. Uh, Dr. Kanan, thank you for speaking to CNN News 18. And, you. you know, I would like to ask you first how you have used future tech, that is the technological usage for taking cancer care to the poorest of the poor. Because if you look at the profile of your patients, almost 80% of your patients are daily wage earners or agricultural laborers, somebody who really cannot afford a lot of expenditure on health care. So through your experience of 15 years, how have you used technology to make sure that the poorest of the poor get access to cancer care? So thank you for having me here today. Before I answer your question, I have to set one fact straight. This uh, um, recognition is not about me. It's not for me. What we have done is enormous teamwork. There are my colleagues in the hospital. There are members of the society. There are volunteers. There are people, supporters in the community here and outside who have supported us in many, many big and small ways. There are researchers, there are like so many people involved in this, in this story, you know. And I think this recognition is for that, that entire human endeavor of so many people together, trying to improve the lot of fellow human beings, you know, one bit at a time. And that's what I think the award truly recognizes in letter and spirit. Technology, I think, is a great leveler. It can, it can make the field level and ensure that people at the last end of the queue, you know, are able to get good quality care without having to sell their assets, without having to sacrifice their wages, without having to move out too far from their homes. Just just our own institution, you know, you know, we, we made use of technology from from for a very long time now. Our whole hospital, the EMR, the hospital medical records are all in-house driven, you know, they are all customized to the way we practice healthcare and just copies it on, on a software format written by my colleagues in the hospital. And that is pretty inexpensive. I know EMRs can be very expensive. These images are of a tele-ICU. So we have an ICU, but we don't have critical care specialists. So we work with a group of physicians located in Bangalore called Cloud Physicians. We put up these big cameras, four or five of them in the ICU. They can see every patient and every monitor. The monitor readings are 